Welcome to Signal and System Lecture Series. Here in this session, I'll be going to explain example on Fourier series with direct form. And to explain that, this is my question, where question is find Fourier series coefficient for cos square t. And there are four options which is given to us. Now see, the basic way of calculation of Fourier series coefficient, that is, I have already explained, it is what a n is equals to 1 by t integration if I say 0 to t then it will be x t into e to the power minus j omega 0 n into t dt but if you see cos square t then calculation of 3 coefficient so that will be very long way of calculation so it will consume it will consume extreme time. So I don't prefer this way to calculate this type of problem. It is very easy problem. So how to do that? So for that, see whenever you have ABCD and if you see Fourier series calculation, then one should understand Fourier series could be represented in this way. You can have coefficient a n b n. You can have coefficient in terms of x of k. You can have coefficient in terms of del of k. So this might be the case which may be given to you to represent Fourier series coefficient. So here we have del of k way to represent Fourier series coefficient. So now all we need to do is we need to expand cos square t and we can compare that it with basic form. So if we expand cos square t then directly one can be able to calculate and compare coefficients and we can predict what is that answer in a, b, c, d. So let us try to do that in this way. So I will be expanding this cos square t in terms of exponential term first. So if I have cos square t then basically cos square t that is 1 plus cos 2t divided by 2. So we can say this is half plus half into cos 2t. Now see this cos 2t that we can represent further in exponential terms. So as we know this is what again e to the power j 2 t plus e to the power minus j 2 t by 2. So this expansion will be further deals with 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 into e to the power j 2 t plus 1 by 4 e to the power minus j 2t. Now we can see this is what in exponential term and we can represent that in terms of del of k. So all we can say is this is having del of k, this is having one shifted version in advance and this is having one delayed version. Right. So we can say this is what 1 by 2 into del of k plus 1 by 4 into del of k plus 1 plus 1 by 4 into del of k minus 1. So this is even one way as I have told you. We can represent this in terms of del or x of or a and b n. So here we have represent that in terms of del of impulse function. So if you observe this answer in ABCD then you will be finding the correct option is this C. So it is just a way to represent that. So here first we need to expand given signal in terms of exponential signal and then we can represent that in some of del function. So here I have represented that. I hope that you have understood this session. Thank you so much for watching this video. You can give your valuable suggestions. Definitely based on it in future I will be making videos which will be solving your queries. And you can download this material from my application. And you can have quick review from there even. And you can learn it online from my videos over here on YouTube channel. Thank you so much.